Welcome back. Oh yeah, we're recording. Okay. It crashed last time when we, we were trying well, to... We did it. We got everything back. When we were trying to come out that door, it crashed and it looked awesome. All right. Let's... It, it showed up on the capture too. So that's cool. So you got to see it. Anyway, call Pona and we're going to go over there and get the mask. Call Pona. No, wait. You don't need her, Pona. You need her to get past this part. No, no, no. You can get to him with that. Oh, never mind. Dag. You know what a dag is? Uh, no. It's like a pe it's like a poop that's stuck to somebody's butt. That's a dag? I thought that was a ningleberry. Well, it, they don't use the word dag over here. Oh, uh, look it up on Urban Dictionary. No. I'm pretty. <laughs> <laughs> Do it. Cause I might be wrong. Cause I feel like I, I think that's what Ross said on Game Grumps once, and then and then like this British guy that was doing a soldering tutorial, he was like, "You don't just want to have dags of soda hanging off of your iron." <laughs> he was the guy that made that Stevie Wonder joke. He was like, <laughs> "The soldering, like, okay, he's over there. We don't have the lens of yeah, we do have the lens of truth. Fuck, what am I saying? This thing is so big. Stevie Wonder could solder this." He's, a, he's sitting there in that thing of rocks. Hold on, you'll have to pinpoint exactly where he is. Because I can't... Get off the this, dag horse. The, the, this game is just, like, really vague, so I have no idea. Um... Can you just, like, walk through him? I wonder if I can just do it. Oh wait, no, I don't have to play the uh, healing. I have to give him the... Yeah, you give him the potion. That's why we got that. Do we have potion right now? I bought one. Oh! Okay, so did Goosebumps books have alliteration? Was that a thing? There was Camp Jelly Jam. No, they didn't. I just made one of them. The Perilous Pajamas. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. You're out of magic! <laughs> You should have just talked to him. If I lift one of these up, it's gonna just ruin the whole thing. He's not gonna show up anymore. I don't think you can get magic from this. Uh, you shouldn't have even been Goron, Link. Oh god, we don't have a thing. Get arrows. I said get arrows. Why would you just kill him from far away so fuck they don't blow you. up? I'm trying to tell you so we can get some magic. Damn. Fuck you. I'm just trying to help. Hey, fuck you. Oh, okay. Fuck you. Seriously? I'm telling you as a friend? <laughs> fuck you. That's really all I needed to hear. I don't Maybe, maybe these guys... <laughs> well, they drop arrows. That's for sure. Oh, God, it's reverted. I told you! He dropped a rupee. Just sit here and tank damage. Cool, cool. The music stopped for a second. Oh, it's because he got near. Is that gonna... Ah, oh, yeah. They reset the countdown. Yeah. Oh my god. Is there anything we can do to get magic back? Hey! Okay, now just do it and be fast about it. Stop, BJ! Oh, that doesn't actually take away magic, does it? It takes it like, really fucking slowly. Talk, talk trying. Don't tell me that. I'm shocked. Many years? Did he say years? How did you eat? So is he wearing the stone mask right now? Is that his problem? Maybe? <laughs> Dude, I drink from that bottle. I'm pretty sure I had to transport someone else's shit in that bottle, and I haven't washed it. 
We had to carry a person in that model. Yeah. Take it, yeah, turn it off. Hey, he's visible. All right. So now what? Let's go to I cannot, can't, oh wait. Wait, can we? We can go up there. Do we, oh, we probably need. No, we need the. We need Zora, don't we? No, we need the hook shot. Oh. Oh we shit, I'm doing the water temple. We need hook shot. No, we get the hookshot from the Pirate's Fortress. But we oh, get I'm not doing the water temple. I'm doing the water temple. I got really upset for a second. The water temple in this game is not that bad. It's still confusing. Yeah, it is. I they probably won't. to put all the puzzles in the water temples. I probably won't remember how to do all of it, so just bear with me on that. I just know it's a big old gear and a big old whirlpool. You gotta turn it different ways to yeah. go into certain holes. Yeah. That's it. Um... I mean, we can go toward Serpentine. the beach, but there's nothing that... I mean, we can get Mikhail's mask, but, like, that's it. We can't really do anything until... Well, we can. That's what... I, I guess... I guess I can play now. As soon as we cross over this. As soon as we cross over to the other side. There you go. But we didn't go into the area yet. Oh, we gotta get a sword. No, we don't. Well, we don't have a sword. Why do we need a sword? Tell me why we need a sword right now. I don't know. We don't need one. But, That's but why. we don't have one. What? We don't have a sword. I know. We don't... I know what I'm doing. We don't have a sword. I know what I'm doing. Okay, what I want to do. We're going to head to the Pirate's Fortress. And we're going to get some of the eggs. Right? Some of the eggs. So this is... Um, they took this level right out of Smash Brothers. Dude, no fucking way. What? The, Miyamoto? I don't think Miyamoto did this. I always called him my coup. Okay, don't just dive under the dude. Just grab his butt. So this part's ridiculous. Oh! Yeah, I love it. Baby! <laughs> Baby! I bet if we could meet him before he was, like, dying, that'd be so cool. Okay, Jesus. What is it with the Zoras in these games have taken forever to do something? Got King oh, Zora yeah. in the first game, yeah, then you got this one. Weep. Weep. This is the only one you meet before you turn before he's turned into a mask, like as a real person. What do you mean? Like Darunia was a ghost, and you never met the Deku, and he's actually alive when you meet him. I wonder if we can just play the Song of Healing without talking to him. Speed up the process. Unless you want to hear it. You gotta he's gotta teach you a song. No, he doesn't. Doesn't he take out his guitar and teach you uh He just takes out his guitar and sings like Oh, Lulu can't sing no more because they stole her eggs. Okay. Well, I guess Do you, you want to hear it? Do you want to hear him say, baby? Because we can do it or we can just speed up through it. I, I kind of want to hear it. All right. Uh, I'll listen. <laughs> it's funny because he was dying. He was around. dying and now he's just like... He's got all that energy. Baby. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Oh. 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 I love that. That's all. Thank you. <laughs> it just falls over. <laughs> anyway, uh, what's the song of healing? Right, left, down. Oh, you were doing it right. Yeah, left, right, down. Yeah. Do do do. Wait, is he dead yet? Am I dead yet? <laughs> Did you kill him? <sighs> wow, okay. I drank a bunch of orange juice and I feel like if I burp too much I'll throw up. I hate when that happens. 
Dude, why are you, how are you floating? I've only thrown up one time. Okay. <laughs> what? I mean, I've only thrown up uh, on by... Burping. By, it, like, as an accident and not being sick or anything. Only by trying once. to burp. No, not by trying to burp. It was when I was doing the cinnamon challenge. Oh. Well, that was not on accident then, was it? Well, I didn't know what the cinnamon challenge was. Derek, Derek was just like, okay, I bet you can't eat the spoonful of cinnamon. And I was like, fuck you, I can. And I ate it, and then he starts laughing. And that makes me start laughing. <laughs> so I, like, inhale it, and it, like, lines your esophagus or something, and it makes it hard to breathe. And then I started coughing a lot, and I threw up in the sink, and then my grandma got mad at me. <laughs> He just goes out rocking. It's spooky. It's, this music is spooky. That ghost is using this a skeleton. This music is spooky. The, the beat should not be that spooky. That ghost was using a skeleton guitar. Oh, God, you're right. Alright, um. I guess what we can go ahead and do. By the way, this is like the most terrifying one. Would people. What, how would they feel about just like. <laughs> Burying a body right there on a public beach. People use this beach. There's Obviously, fucking, there's like parasols and towels down. Yeah. There's a dead body not ten feet away from them. Dude, okay, this these swimming controls are so good. It's because they're fast. Yeah. Hit that. Oh my god. We don't need a sword. Shut up. We don't need a sword! Wait, oh, shut up. We don't need a sword! Shut up! I wasn't thinking about that. I was I was waiting for you to figure that out. You should have told me! If you knew, I don't believe you knew though. I didn't know. I think you're just being a shithead. <laughs> yeah, 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 well, you know me. <laughs> God, this feels so good to swim though. I think I already missed the pirate. Sports. They were the same in Skyward Sword, and somehow they fucked it up. Because it was motion. Because it was motion controlled. That's why. That was the only part in the game where that where like the motion controls just weren't responding to me. They worked fine for me. Like there's never a point where they didn't work fine for me. There's just that one part. There were like I had to like keep recalibrating it or something. Damn, that was an epic dive, bro. I did like what they were trying to do with the, uh, not actually using the sensor bar. But there, it was kinda... had a lot of input lag because of it. But I didn't need to point it at the TV. Yeah. Which was nice, I mean... I think, I think the aiming game. controls of Twilight Princess were a lot better than the ones on Skyward Sword, though. Ow! Someone on V said it best. Uh, they said that all every Wii developer should play Resident Evil 4 first, so they know how to do the Wiimote controls right. Because that was the best game for Wiimote controls. Do they not care? I'm wearing the stone mask. Oh, right. Oh, this is just easy peasy mode now, isn't it? Oh yeah, that's why. That's why this. That's. I, I've never done this with a stone mask. I just imagine it's super hard. I can't remember ever doing it. Without the stone mask? I can't remember doing it. Oh, doing it in general? <laughs> it's... Uh... I remember the Ocarina of Time one, but not this. Really? I don't know why I just couldn't do that Maybe before. I don't remember it because I used the stone mask. It's probably it. Yeah, it's not super hard. Anyway, we're only going to be getting one egg this time. Because we only have one One bottle. egg! But that's okay. Handful of peas. One egg. Handful of peas. What are you doing? Rhythm heaven. Uh, the munchy monk. Rhythm heaven fever. Okay, don't do that. It's not what I wanted you to do. <sighs> Skeleton fishes. Skeleton. They're called fit. Fi they're called bonefish. I was rather call them fistulas. Fistulas. That's from. Uh, well, that's an actual thing, but it's also it's a boss in the Binding of Isaac. Yeah. Speaking of which, Rebirth is so good. Would you say it's better or it's better. worse than Majora's Mask? Oh. <laughs> you, you thought I was gonna do something. I else. thought I, I did. You got me there. 
Uh, I mean, I prefer Majora's Mask because it's What's your favorite indie game? Probably Binding of Isaac. Mine would be Cave Story. I've never actually played Cave Story. Good ass game. I want controller support. And apparently it's a Metroidvania. Cave Story's got controller support. Or Cave Story Plus does. Huh. I'd have to buy Cave Story Plus though. Fuck that. You can use the X-Patter. Fuck that. I don't know, Good games sound. like that, like like games like that and like Risk of Rain and stuff, I like to use controller on it if I can. Well, I've, the first time I ever played it was on PSP. Because somebody made it for the homebrew. Because it was, I guess it was open source or something like that. Okay, I said dive. I wish that they had widescreen support. PSP version does. Well, you know what I don't get? I don't get these, like, people, like, releasing these games from, like, on Steam, these indie developers, and not having them in widescreen. Like, they still have them in 4x3. Like, what eh. fucking shithole country are you from where they haven't invented the widescreen yet? <laughs> it's not Poland, because... Wait, is it, is, is it Poland or Sweden that uh, does The Witcher? Sweden, I think. I think it's Poland. I don't fucking know. Ah. Uh, whatever. The Super Hexagon doesn't even support 16 by 9. Don't like you fucking need that in Super Hexagon. It's just annoying. It'd be no trouble on the developer's part to make it 16 by 9. And same with, uh... Persona 4 Arena. Apparently Wait, that's, that's not 16 by 9? It's 16 by 10. You have a little bit of black bars on the side, apparently. Uh, that's what I used to play on 16 by 10. <laughs> I had to play uh, 1440 by 900 resolution on my old monitor. 16 by 10 stupid. Go big or go home. I'm inclined to agree with you. I'd much prefer having 1920 by 1080. I mean, really, that's just, that's the, that's just the standard. That, that aspect ratio is just supported by, like, everything or nothing. Hey, oh! I remember having a weird resolution for one of my monitors, apparently, and I was playing a uh, zombie survival Gary's mod, and I was in the menu, and it had an option to go straight to the, uh, to the zombies cut in half, where normally you can only get that when you were a normal zombie getting cut in half. But it was like, if you can see this, you're the one of the weird peoples with so-and-so by so-and-so resolutions. Like, apparently it was hidden to everybody that wasn't using that resolution. That's funny. Uh... I don't think I need to be Goron Link anymore. Well, we'll see if he needs to be Goron Link or not next time. Well, hold on. On Majora's Mask. You gonna, you're just gonna fucking keep going? I was just gonna get up here real quick. That does not... That does, I don't think that would work. It doesn't. Anyway, guys, bye!